guys, Vicki Stark here, and I know what some of you guys are thinking. Why aren't you fishing? Why aren't you on a boat? And why aren't you in a bikini right now? Well, I am going to be doing that this weekend, but for this video, I am going to be packing my suitcase. I'm going to be showing you guys what I bring on my fishing trips um, along the lines of what bikinis I wear, what hats I wear, uh, the face masks, buffs that I wear. Um, also, you know, the little things that you don't think about, like sunscreen, um, what shoes you're going to wear on the boat. Um, all of that I am going to cover in this video. So make sure to give me a big thumbs up if you guys like this video. Make sure to hit that subscribe button for many more videos. So I'm going to the Bahamas to Chub Key uh, this weekend, and I've never been to Chub before, so I'm really excited. Going over with some friends uh, who love to fish. I've never caught a blue marlin. Never caught a black marlin, so those are two fish on my bucket list for this trip, and I'm um, really hoping that I can catch one, but either way, it's going to be a fun trip, um, and I get to wear some of the new scales gear that I just got, actually just got, um, in the mail. Mail, mail. Mailman just came, so let's open it up, see what I got, and then I'm going to try some stuff on and show you guys some of the bikinis that Scales Gear just came out with recently. It's their new line. It's, ugh, the, the bikinis are gorgeous. They fit so well. The material's great. That's the reason why I teamed up with Scales and, and joined their team. Uh, I just, I love the product. Um, I wear a lot of bikinis, and bikinis are a high standard for me for, you know, which ones I'm gonna wear, honestly, because most of them don't really fit right. Um, or they just don't look cute. So, scales, gear, bikinis always look really cute on me, and most girls as well. So, um, I'm going to show you guys some of those. But, let's see what else we got. Alright, so I'm going to start out with um, some of the bikinis. So, give me one second, and I'm going to go try them on and show you guys. Alright guys, first up is probably my favorite bikini right now. It's the blue camo scales bikini. Um, it's so soft. It fits so well. Um, it's, you know, a little bit minimal coverage in the back, which is fine. Um, Getting get me a little tan. Just really supportive, really pretty material, really bright, vibrant blue material, uh, which I like. I, re I like really bright, vibrant bikinis. Um, paired it with this little hat, teal hat from Scales, and you can see the pretty detail on the bikini. Um, yeah, I just yeah really like this bikini. Can't wait to wear this one. Um, I hopefully will be wearing this one when I catch a blue marlin in the Bahamas. Um, but so stay tuned and see. So this is a medium top and a small bottom for all you ladies out there or for the guys out there looking to get um, some bikinis for their ladies. Uh, medium tops, small bottoms, that's what I wear and fits nice. Can't wait to wear it. Maybe I'll pair it with a cute little hat. Something like that to protect me a little bit more. Um, I always get asked the question, do you wear sunscreen? Make sure you wear sunscreen. Yes, I always wear sunscreen, guys. I, I wear at least 30 to 50 SPF all the time. I do like to get a little bit of a tan. So, I'll, you know, I cover myself probably 50% of the time when I'm on the boat with long sleeve, with hat, with a buff. Um, but then, you know, I do also like to tan. So I'll, you know, take off my top and wear a bikini and get a little bit of sun and you know, nothing wrong with that. Okay, next up is the Scales Long Sleeve Performance Fit T-shirt. Um, it's SPF, so I'm not gonna get burnt by the sun. This is kind of what I'm gonna wear pretty much 50% of the time that I'm on the boat or more to protect my skin from the sun. It's got a really cute, cute little design on the back. Um, cute design in the front. They have ladies and men's gear. The men's gear is really awesome as well, so guys, go check that out. I'm going to put their link in the description below so you guys can head on over there and get some scales gear also. All right. 
right, guys, next bikini that I will be bringing on the trip with me is this really pretty purple swordfish print bikini. Um, it's got really cute detail, which I love. I have another one of their bikinis with this detail on the bikini bottom. They're just really cute little fishing lures. Um, I don't know if you can see that. They're just really, really cute detail um, that they put on the bikinis. And again, this top has the really pretty uh, braided detail up top. Um, this bottom is a little bit more conservative coverage on the back, but um, still really cute, really sexy, and uh, I can't wait to wear this one on the boat. I also have um, a really cute buff to go with it. Here it is. Um, so besides Scales Gear, that is one of my sponsors. Hoorag is one of my sponsors as well. I'll put their link in the description below so you guys can go check them out. Um, that is their logo, Hoorag. Um, this, is, uh, this is a swordfish print um, buff. So going to match this bikini perfectly. I really like to bring a good amount of face masks with me. Um, you never know what's going to happen. Maybe one gets wet, maybe one's stinky, like smells like fish because someone wiped their hands on it. Maybe someone else on the boat doesn't have one, didn't bring one, which has happened to me a lot. Um, and they get, you know, people use them, they get taken. Um, I've got a stack of face masks that I am bringing on this trip, even though I'm gone for five days. I've got probably eight, nine face masks, um, just in case. So you can never be too prepared. So I'll put these in my suitcase. All right. Uh, next up, if you guys follow me on Instagram, um, or you've watched my fly fishing video, um, here on YouTube, you've seen this bikini before, just got this one recently. I love it. I get so many compliments on this one. So this one is a little cute fish print. Um, again, the material is really soft. It's great quality, uh, very well made by Scales Gear. Um, I'm wearing a uh, medium top and small bottom. And uh, I would probably pair this one with a little cute little tank top on the boat. Um, I know it's going to be really hot in the Bahamas, so um, this is a really cute little mahi, mahi um, scales tank top. It's got the little scales logo in the back. It's got the little scales logo in the back, and yeah, this one, you know, this is just a really cute bikini to, to wear um, with the tank top and um, I throw some leggings on sometimes when I'm fishing, especially if it's cold out. Um, some of the leggings, some of the leggings I'm gonna be bringing with me, um, I've got these really cute, cute marlin print leggings. Um, I've also got these really, really cute um, wahoo print. Wahoo print from Clutch Apparel. Um, these I haven't worn yet, and I'm really excited to wear these in the Bahamas. Maybe we'll catch a wahoo on the way over. Um, I'm taking the boat over with, um, with the crew and then flying back on Monday. So we're gonna be doing a lot of fishing, and um, I'm gonna have a lot more videos for you guys from me fishing in all of this gear uh, coming up next week. So stay tuned for that. Um, okay, last bikini. Okay, last bikini, it's the blue uh, Wahoo print. This one I've had uh, for a couple weeks, and I really love this one as well. Um, again, I really like blue and blue bikinis. Um, this one's got the really cute detail also, and cute little scales detail there. This bikini is just really comfortable and I feel comfortable, confident in it, feel sexy. Um, this one I would probably pair with another cute little tank top that Scales just sent me. 
And that's this one. Cute little black black tank with the Skills logo. Um, it's got the Skills logo on the back as well. A couple other things that I wanted to show you guys real quick. Um, I always bring a tumbler on the boat so I can have a cool uh, water or Gatorade or something on the boat. Um, this one is from Orca. Orca coolers, I put a cute little decal on it. Um, the nice thing about these cups that Yeti doesn't do, and I don't know why they don't do it, but Orca's just, you know, the best. Um, it's these little Orca tails that snap on and your drink doesn't spill. So I could be out walking the dogs or running or, or on the boat and it's my drink is not going anywhere. So I absolutely love the Orca tumblers. You guys can go get those. Um, I'll put the link for Orca coolers in the description below also. Um, another thing that I'm bringing, of course, is my sunglasses. Um, these are the only sunglasses I wear, and they're called Far Out Sunglasses. Um, I do not wear any other sunglasses. I don't wear Costas. Um, I don't even know the names of the other brands, honestly, because this is all I wear. They're polarized, they're lightweight. Um, there's so many cute different colors. That was a light blue. This is like a bluish green. Um, I've got purple ones to match my purple bikinis. And I just, I love the far out sunglasses because they're cheap too. You know, if you lose them, which I've lost some expensive sunglasses overboard on the boat before and you just you feel like crap all day because you've lost two hundred fifty dollars you know these all are pretty cheap um, between you know twenty dollars to forty dollars um, depending on which ones you get but they're awesome polarized super cute different colors and styles and I highly highly suggest these um, sunglasses from far out I will put their uh, link in the description below also so you guys can check them out um, and okay, almost done. I'm going to show you guys a couple more things. Um, shoes. I always bring a pair of boots on the boat. Um, these are extra tough. I've got a couple pairs of these. Um, these are the ladies. I've got a pair of ladies teal ones also, and then a pair of um, knee high ones that are really great. Super comfortable. Um, these are also extra tufts. Uh, these are just cute little boat shoes, you know. Um, they're just, you can pretty much wear them anywhere. You could wear them out to the bar, you could wear them to the pool, to, you know, out fishing, obviously. Um, and these are just classic brown. Um, they kind of look like Sperry's, which I like, but they're more durable and they are by extra tough. I will put extra tufts link in the description below for you guys as well so you can go visit their page and um, get some cool gear. Another thing I always bring on the boat is at least one sweater. Um, this is a hoodie that is from Scales Gear. Um, just super easy to you know throw on. Um, if it gets cold at night I can toss it on or just kind of wrap it around. Um, but I always have at least one hoodie in case you never know what the weather is going to do. And speaking of weather, in case it rains, I always bring, I do always bring um, a little bit of foul weather gear. I'm not going to bring my Grundens this trip. Um, I usually bring them on the boat when I'm local, but because I'm going to the Bahamas and I don't have a lot of room, I'm just going to bring this rain jacket. Um, this is from Hook. This is all I need really. Um, if it rains, I am set and I'm protected from the rain and um, I can put my sweater underneath if it gets cold too. got enough room and throw my boots on and I'm all good to go. So I will be packing this. All right guys, last up and I think most important uh, for this Bahamas trip is obviously my passport. I've got that. Um, and my GoPro equipment. I've got 
different um, handles I can use. Got one that wraps around the pole. Got my charger. Got my GoPro. Um, I'm going to be taking a lot of videos on this trip. Uh, hopefully, we're going to be catching a lot of fish. It's going to be beautiful, and I've got a lot more videos coming at you guys very soon. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure you hit that thumbs up button, uh, like this video, and subscribe to my page for more videos to come. Um, I'd also love to hear what you guys have to say in the comment section below. Let me know what you think of the video, what you think of the gear that I'm bringing, the bikinis, the boots, the sunglasses. Also, let me know what you guys bring on your fishing trips with you. I'd love to hear what you guys bring on your fishing trips, whether it's a fishing vacation like I'm taking for a couple of days or it's just a one day fishing trip, let me know maybe what I'm leaving out. Um, some things that maybe I didn't think about that I'd love to pack for my next trip. Um, I'd love to hear from you guys, love to interact and um, hear all of your fishing adventures as well. So thank you guys so much again for watching and continuing to follow along on all of my fishing adventures. Um, I really, really appreciate it. And I will see you guys next time. Make sure you subscribe to my page for more videos.